mobility and, and transport is a key trouble child in climate action. So emissions in Austria and many other European countries rose in the last years and decades, but they need to decrease, they need to decline sharply. And so why did we do the climate ticket? We want to make public transport as attractive as possible for the people. From north, south, east, west, you can hop on every bus, every train, every tram, every subway with one ticket for the equivalent of three euro per day, 1,095 euro per year. For the users and for the customers, the climate ticket works quite uh, easy. You can either go into the online shop or you can go to one of many ticket counters all uh, across Austria. Please don't forget an uploadable uh, picture, that's very important. And uh, after a few minutes, you're a proud owner of a Klima ticket. Our simulations suggested that we are talking about a potential of around 110,000 people. And these numbers were already exceeded uh, after one month of pre-sale last October. At the moment, we are very happy that we have over 180,000 people using the Klima ticket. So my daily habits are, well, I'm a student, so it's always a bit different. Sometimes I'm at the university, which I go by the train or also by just public uh, buses. Sometimes I'm at work. My work is currently in Vienna and I'm living in Linz. So that means I have to go by train to Vienna. Before I had to pay like 20 euros a month for only Linz, in, for the Linz area to take the bus or take the uh, railway. In, to go to Vienna, I had to pay like 34 euros, uh, just one way. That sums up uh, a lot of euros. And then I choose the climate ticket because it's way more comfortable, way easier to just to have one ticket. I can use it anywhere, however I like it. And that's just way more comfortable and also much cheaper. Building the ticket from a user perspective was really for us the key aspect in this. As easy and as affordable as possible because that makes the the entrance barrier, I, I call it like this for public dance, but it just lowers it uh, really um, very much. The Klima Ticket Österreich is financed by the revenues we get from selling of the tickets and by public funds. Obviously, there was a big worry with the um, public transport sector, with the uh, regional governments, that we would put a lot of money in the ticket and forget about the rest of public transport. And I always said from the very beginning, the ticket is just one part. We need to invest in good infrastructure. We also expand the offer of public transport. And we need an affordable ticket to make public transport your number one choice and just the most normal thing to use. And in proving that I take all three things seriously, I think that was also for, for many um, in the discussions an important um, part to actually know that, that we will continue to finance all three parts of public transport. But of course, a lot of partners, a lot of questions, a lot of hours of work and negotiation, but every single minute and every single hour worth it. We had to tackle legal issues. We had to find methods and systems where we could remunerate the transport companies for the revenue losses they face when we implemented the climate ticket. We had to manage all the external service providers when it comes to the distribution of the ticket, when it comes to the uh, marketing, when it comes to customer service. Public transport is such an important factor in climate action that we wanted to make it very clear also in the name of this ticket that every time you use it, you're doing something good for the climate. And doing something for the climate can be easy, can be fun, can be cheap. Actually, it's a lot cheaper than uh, the ticket used to be for many people in our country. So that was also the idea to, to have a very positive climate project associated uh, with the name.